Hey all, welcome back to another Need for Speed Carbon video. I hope you are all excited for this series. Today I'm going to put a custom livery on the RX-8 in a way that I think matches the whole aesthetic of the game. I will pretty much be using the shapes category for the whole design. Now it's been forever since the last time I did a vinyl design in Carbon, but I forgot about some of the issues I had with the game system. You can already see that the shapes have these really bad black edges that remain visible even if you put the shapes on top of each other, making complex designs look like a weird digital arts and crafts project. But no biggie, I just have to keep that in mind and try to make sure it adds to the overall look, or at the very least doesn't take away from it. You might find this hard to believe, but this is actually inspired by the design of Nila's RX-8 in Tokyo Drift, where a design covers the front half of the car with darker colors, and the back half just has the base paint. The color scheme is obviously inspired by the Joker. Uh, yeah, now there was an issue with being able to afford the vinyl setup, so I did have to cheat in money. I figured you guys wouldn't mind since it's all aesthetics anyways. I didn't use anything I wasn't supposed to have at this point in the playthrough. I did have to cheat in money twice though, because each time I wanted to save my progress, it costed the same eight or ten thousand dollars. But don't worry, I made sure that after the money was spent, that I would have the same amount I had at the end of the last recording, so that I wouldn't have a cheater's advantage. But anyways, that's the vinyl livery of the RX-8. Looks pretty good, I think. Could be better, but the game has a limit for how many vinyls can be on one car. I especially like how it looks from the front. The weird purple edges from the shapes overlapping actually look kind of cool. But now it's time for some crew personalization. I realized I hadn't edited the colors of my crew logo yet, so I made the snake into a neat purple and green combo. And now I'm going to do Neville's car. I'm not going to change much because I spent about an hour on my RX-8, but I will make his car purple and his wheels and windows green. And there you have it. I really prefer this game's level of customization over Most Wanted because you can do so much more with the vinyls. Well, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I look forward to posting the next episode of the playthrough. I hope to see you guys next time. Subscribe if you are cool. And I'm the Racing Joker, signing out. Take care and keep it crazy.